with the 2014-15 PGA season, kick, PGA Tour season kicking off this week. Well, it won't be long before the RBC Heritage will That's be right. around the corner next April. Ray Angel in his final year as the general chairman of all of the different volunteer groups that are involved. A lot of them. Yeah. Oh, he, he, what, what? And we could do a whole show. We uh, certainly could. Telling, Ray telling stories, I'm sure. You're here to get us wound up and get some new volunteers, get some new blood in for this coming year, Ray. Uh, welcome to the show. Uh, tell us a little bit about how folks can get involved. Thank you very much. And uh, with uh, the 15th season coming up here, uh, 2015, we're going to need probably about uh, 250 new volunteers. Wow. We had 970 volunteers this year. We lose maybe in a neighborhood of 20 or 25 percent for various reasons. We will have a recruiting session at Sun City on October the 15th, Pickney Hall from 9 until 2 for Sun City residents. And then the next week, the 22nd of October, we will have a recruiting session at Palmetto Electric for Sun City and all residents in the area. And that will be from 10 until 2. We will have six committee chairmen represented there for the committees that need volunteers. The Marshall Committee is the largest by far. Over 30% of our volunteers are in the Marshall Committee. Wow. So we will need uh, marshals, and that's crowd control, traffic control, plantation drive. We have barricades to keep the cars quiet while the golfers are putting and teeing off. Shot link laser. We have laser operators on the fairways and at the greens to determine distances. That's a fun job. That is, Beam it's, it's a really yeah, great cool. job. A lot of people uh, like that job. Uh -huh. uh, hospitality ambassadors that work in the uh, hospitality venues uh, to help our people there. And the volunteer tent, which we're extending hours, will now be from Monday until Sunday instead of starting on Wednesday, as all transportation for our volunteers will be through the volunteer tent. Ray, for somebody that is looking to be a new volunteer, has not been with you before, what are some of the requirements they need to know that they Skill need to wise. have to be with yeah. you? Yeah. The Marshall Committee, uh, as I mentioned, being the largest, we require four shifts at roughly four to five hours, but that is standing, so you have to be able to stand for that period of time. Other committees, you're sitting down. All of the uh, committees that will need people can uh, explain the duties. We. Uh, should uh, also say that there is a hundred dollar registration fee. Each volunteer will receive a hat, a shirt, a windbreaker. They supply their own black pants, meal tickets for all days that they're working, preferential parking, the use of the volunteer tent, and the ability at Uniform Pickup to purchase up to four ground passes at half price. Sounds like an exciting time oh, to be a volunteer. Is. Great time. How can people find out more info if they want to get involved? Please call Bonnie Hunt at the tournament office at 843-671-2448. She will put them in touch through their uh, internet and they can uh, register. Registrations are now open. They've been open for about a week and we have about 300 volunteers that have already registered. That's well, fantastic. Well, Ray, thank you so much for being with yeah. us and for all your years of terrific <laughs> service. Thank you very much.